Hey guys, I'm back at the uh, historic school. Uh, I'm gonna do another hunt. This will be uh, part three. I got a new camera. My other one burnt out, and I got a new machine, an F75. So uh, this will be my first hunt with this one, but it's a lot like my T2, so I uh, shouldn't have any problems uh, doing anything. Um, I'll show you when I find something cool. All right. Hey, I had a target probably about six inches deep and then there was still another target in the hole turned out to be some kind of a square piece of iron but on top of that was a coin uh -huh. just a memorial scent what a fake out show you if I get anything else hey guys I had another target about six inches deep and I popped out some kind of green coin can't really tell what it is I mean it's bigger than a penny but it's awfully green I'll have to clean this up and show you at the end of the hunt show you if I find anything else all right guys another weird target uh, got me a green fork and look too old to me. We'll clean it up later and check it out. Show you if I get anything else. All right, guys, I got a jumpy uh, tab signal. If you can see in there, looks like a ring, some sort. Awesome. It's got some kind of engraving in it. Hopefully, it's not junk, but I don't know. I'll have to look and uh, see if I see a mark on it, and I'll get back with you. All right. Hey guys, I got another little bit of a choppy sound, and uh, uh, maybe four inches. So I got a piece of fired lead flattened out a uh, small ball show you if I get anything else all right guys I just got a high tone it's hard to see because of the lighting but silver in the hole awesome let's show you the date oh it's like 1952 1952 Washington awesome finally got some silver today sweet show if I get any more hey guys I got a signal eh, six inches maybe you got some kind of button it's got a shield on it oops oh, it's a that's a pin. Must not be that old. Got a little shield. Looks shiny. Maybe it's silver. I'll let you know later. Hey guys, I'm back from my hunt. Uh, first time out with my F75. And I got some clad. There's uh, dimes, uh, pennies, nickels, a few quarters. Got, uh, looks like a fired lead ball right here. And then uh, here's my big fake out. It's plated. Plated ring. There's an L or something engraved on there. Well, you can see it's coming off a little bit. But still pretty cool. And then here's my 1952 quarter. No mint mark on that. It looks to be in a pretty nice condition. And then this little uh, pin, and it does say sterling on there, extremely small on the back, so there's two silver. And 1918 Weedy, really green, but uh, pretty good shape. 
Then a V nickel. Very hard to identify this. It's extremely crusty and uh, all the shiny stuff's worn off and it's either 1911 or 1914. So uh, thanks for watching and uh, happy hunting guys.